this video will show you how to use the satellite view. Let's uh, go ahead and, well, let's pull up a new design here, or an existing design, I should say, Life Alliance. Okay. That design is a digitized design. The way you can tell your object manager, rather than stitch packs, has actual object types, path, column, running, stitch, zigzag, and whatnot. Also, if you just turn off your stitches, you can see the wireframe on the screen. Let's turn the stitches back on and the wireframe off. Let's do a zoom total. Okay, so say that you're working on this design and very common scenario when working with, say, letters like this would be probably for you to zoom in to different corners of your, you know, particularly where the letters connect and you want to double check, make sure you got the right lock stitches or the right uh, place for the letters to connect. By the way, sometimes when you look at this, you're not sure where, you know, whether that letter connects over to the next from that point or from that point. You can turn your connectors on and you get dotted lines for, you know, it shows you exactly where your embroidery machine would make that connect. So you're looking at this and, you know, you do your editing and whatnot and now you want to, you know, continue checking the other parts of your design. Well, you could zoom all the way back out and then, you know, zoom back into a different corner of your design and, and do like that, you know, all day long. But you can also, okay, you can also use your satellite view. On the view tab of your ribbon, click on the satellite view and notice that we get this little box, okay? Now that little box, sometimes you may get a little box, sometimes you may get a big box, it all depends where you are zoomed in on your design. Like if I were to do a zoom total on my design, notice how now my box, okay, allows me to draw my own box. And that's basically how you can use your satellite view. If you zoom into any corner, say right there between the I and the A, watch how my satellite view reflects that and it gives me that little box. So once I'm done checking that corner, if I need to move to the connection point between the A and the N, I can just grab that actual box and move all the way over here. I can move all the way here. I can pan my way around the design. If I need to check the dot on that I, I can just go right to it. So without seeing my whole design on the screen, the satellite view is a great way to pan you know, around my design, particularly when you're zoomed in, okay? So you can retain the zoom level that you're comfortable with, and you can just keep that and just move to different areas of your design. It's also a quick way to go from one end of the design to the other. Say that, you know, you check at the end of the E, okay, because that's the end of the first word, you may want to make sure that there's a lock stitch or trims and whatnot, actually looks that the E sews backwards to the F and from the F okay that's the lock stitch of the F right there let's turn our trims on let's see if that yeah okay looks like that's a lock stitch and that's a trim on the F before it moves to the dot of the I so now say that you want to check at the end of the word alliance okay you can just either drag that box over or you can just come over here and draw your own box okay notice that whichever size of box I draw, it instantly reflects in my design area, in my main window, and it shows me, you know, the new zoom box. Again, that satellite view is what allows me to do all that. Very handy to pan around on your, you know, to pan around your design at any given zoom level. Okay, or just draw your own box to quickly zoom into a different spot of your design. And that's basically uh, how you use the satellite view.